Well, listen, I can tell you firsthand that when I pulled up to the studio, first of all, what a beautiful neighborhood you live in. It's an amazing view. And then you. secondly, you got to kind of walk uphill and then walk up the stairs. And it, it just it just feels grander in a way. I don't know how to explain it. It, it has a cool vibe. Our downstairs studio room houses a solid state logic 40, uh, 48 E series company with APIs. And then the, uh, the new room up here, be right behind me, uh, the SSL 4072 G series, uh, that there, um, uh, we have the duality SEV3, which is a, an incredible council. It's very updated. Um, it's one of the, the best council that Solid State Logic puts out. It's it's an incredible routing council. Um, it's just I mean it's got all the bells and whistles in it. You, you wouldn't believe it. I mean you could be working Pro Tools, and we just got certified as an avid learning partnership here. So I mean our students can be in Pro Tools domain and be in the box like watching the faders going up and down, up and down, and be able to bring that hard drive here. Type in a, a, a sync a, a, a information to the computer, and what it does, it, it turns the duality with the servo motors and the faders into analog. So they can basically mix that. We're doing the update of the Delta right now. So I haven't seen that happen, but it's right around the corner. So that's, that's something that I'm really looking forward to, uh, is, is be able to see the faces of the students when they come in and they mix something. They hear the drum tracks as they're recording down the live room, bass, guitars, pianos, whatever it is, and then come up and be able to plug that in their hard drive. So, I mean, you've accomplished so much in your career. You, you have so many decades of work under your belt. What keeps you going? Why do you still do this? Energy from my wife, Tina. A lot of, like, the, the bands, the people that have, have come here, they keep, like going like, hey, come on, come on, keep going with this. You know, it's, my back has been, yeah, my body is like beat, you know, from working here and not only here, but going down to Mexico and, and keeping up with the Mexican studs, you know, out of the village. So, you know, um, but it's just, it's the, it's the dream. It's something pushes me uh, to do it. And, uh, you know, it's people that are in my life that, that have me do this. And I feel very honored that when, uh, you know, we've got people come here, especially lately, it's been the student education program. It's been students that come here that look in my eyes and go, wow, we're so honored to be here in the building. I, I try to stay humble about it, Daniel, you know, but it's, it's, you can take the, the records on the walls and stuff like that. It's like, you know, I don't really care. It, it's seeing the, the young adults smiling when they first hit the, the, you know, got somebody out there hitting the kick drum and snare and the toms and uh, getting the sounds coming in and seeing their vibe. And, uh, you know, that's what really keeps keeps me going uh, is the influctuation of, of students that come here. Now we, we've got three classes going on. It's a major, major success. Richmond Beach has got, this is an old community. It's a incredible atmosphere view that spells out like a really good really super good environment to come into and then i mean just do what you need to do you know in my particular situation here uh, one thing that i'm really happy about is that you know when we still are doing you know band stuff here too when i can um and what i end up doing is like having like the band come in let's just say if it's a, a it's a three-day project uh, if it's a weekend project, what I do is I have the the, uh, uh, the bands come in, load in, like on Friday night. And so they come in on Friday night, and then I have my students participate in getting like a input mic list from the producer, the engineer of the band. And uh, they will set up all the microphones, get the band in headsets. So the students are part of the setup in our three studios here. We're currently building a fourth one, and that's in the... The Bat Cave room, which um, half a basketball court, uh, the Bat Cave area, uh, that room that I constructed all these years ago uh, starts with my neighbor's wall caving in, right? Uh, 83. How old am I? Um, that there is, is, we're starting to do some work in there right now. And that will be a Studio D control room. And the 4072 will go down into a submerged concrete building within the building itself. 
and uh, then we'll um, I'll get like an Avid S6 coming up here on on this uh, on this control room. But yeah, I mean it never stops. We just keep going.